Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Make sure you all subscribe to me if you are not, okay? Um, this is gonna be just a general message, okay, for the collective. If you are in here, then obviously there is something in here for you, okay? Here, um, this also could be a cross watching ass energy as well. Don't know for sure. It's kind of weird all that damn noise is in the background all of a sudden because it was just quiet as hell in here. Um, I hope you all are having a blessed day. <laughs> Let's get into this reading and see what the hell is going on, guys. Okay. Thank you all so much for your compliments. Because I know y'all like down her hair is nice, nails nice, outfit nice. Thank you. Let's see what's going on with family masculine today. Okay. One more. Thank you. So. You're being called to have some kind of compassion here because you are definitely prosperous in any situation. I feel like you, you've never forgotten what people have done to you, but don't let that, you know, be a reason why, look, compassion fail. Don't let that be a reason why, you know, you have a hard heart is what I heard. So your root chakra, can y'all see that? If you can't, sorry. Roots. Root chakra, whatever the fuck. Okay, allowance. Y'all know I'm not lying. Discernment. <laughs> Y'all know I'm not lying. I ain't got to do all that. Fuck that. <laughs> like, see. Okay. So, automatically with root chakra, allowance, discernment, I do want to say that I'm feeling like um, there's something that is about to happen, something that's about to change you for the better or the worse. And, you know, it's, it's just something that you're going to have to, you know, deal with because there's no other option. You need to use your discernment at this time for who the fuck is coming in your life and who's going out. The people that you don't want there, you need to have some kind of discernment here. Okay, here. I feel like people are playing a whole lot of fucking games. You know, these people, they, they do too fucking much is what I feel like. I feel like motherfuckers just need to mind their motherfucking business, but they always got some kind of strategy here for you, fam masculine, all the time. It's like somebody always got some kind of plots or a plan. And that shit is irritating me. What's the uh, root chakra? Why is root chakra here? Yeah, because somebody's not healing. And maybe you're not going to be able to heal something here with this person, maybe. Who knows? No, no. Yeah, because you're on your path. You got journey and the fucking temple path coming out together. The door to um, personal healing and happiness. And somebody's very envious of that. Now, the thing about all of this is what I feel. I feel, like I said, a bitch need to mind her business. A nigga need to mind their fucking business, bro. Envy. They're not balanced. This person don't have no balance in their life. They have nothing. The only thing that they got is you and everything that you're doing and trying to block that shit, period. Which is very goddamn sad. But that's what they do. That's what these people do, bro. Period. They, they, that's just what the fuck they do, man. I can't explain it to you why. I can just tell you that's what hoes and niggas do. Period. They will never have a life. They won't ever have nothing else other than you to worry about, bro. They just won't. Envy is here. The angel of balance. And goddamn, the, oh, hell no. Nah. Deceit too. This is a very deceiving energy here. Or you could be in a deceit energy. See your daughter value. Look at this. It's always because of something. Somebody's mad because you're getting fucking money. They don't like the fact that you're blessed by the universe. They don't like the fact that God favors you. They don't like anything about you. Whoever this is that I'm reading, you're very talented. 
Um, you do a whole lot of shit. I heard you wear many hats. You might literally love hats, like any kind of hat, <laughs> any kind. But there's the deceit right there at the bottom. And it's the ending. Okay, Angel of Love. Our Angel Michael is here. Angel of Love. This angel here, I'm gonna just tell you right now, it's nothing you can do when our angel Michael is in the fucking building. Anytime our angel Michael shows up in my readings, I already know it's bullshit. I know it's bullshit because not, you know, not on your behalf, collective, but on behalf of your enemies. And he's not even active, so he's already done something here. Something has already been done. Our angel Gabriel is active, though. You need to definitely, uh, at this time, be using your um, discernment here. Why else is discernment here? Blossoming abundance. This shit is all because of the things that you're doing to accomplish your goals. Somebody's jealous, they're mad, and they wanna, you know, try to prevent you from doing something. Somebody um, is, I feel, doing some kind of work on your root chakra. This could even be somebody just in the community. You don't even have to know this person. But this person is a weirdo. Bro, these folks are creeps. Period. This shit irks me, bro. Because it's like, damn, can I ever do a fucking reading without somebody being in y'all business? No. The answer is fucking no. No, I can't do a reading without somebody being in your business because you are all these people have. Without you, they don't got shit. Period. They don't. These people are in competition with you when there's clearly no competition. But in their mind, many people feel like because they're throwing magic at you left and fucking right that they're in a competition. Half of y'all don't even know this shit is going on, bruh. How the fuck are we in competition? How are we fighting? How are we playing the game when I don't even realize that I'm involved in this shit? The fuck? Somebody is really mad and they're a fucking loser and they always will be. I feel like this is a scorpion losing ass nigga or a bitch. I'm sure the death card gonna come out. The motherfucking tower and everything else here. Root chakra. Yeah, they're not changing their mind. And they're mad because you got some kind of gift here. You're blessed, masculine fam. You're very fucking blessed. And you're blessed with spiritual gifts. You know, that um, are meant to help other people. And this person just doesn't like that shit. They're, they don't have it. They never fucking will. Courthouse. Sudden wealth. Somebody was trying to steal some shit from you. Thief, despair, they were trying to steal shit. But see, the thing about it is, bitch, once you saw that you were losing, why don't you just back the fuck out, ho? This person really feels like they're gonna win something. They're not winning anything. You could be in some kind of courtship with this person. You could be dating this person. I don't fucking know. And somebody's also going to jail and they're never getting out because they tried to steal some kind of sudden wealth from you, period. Oh, here's what the fuck spirit said. Pathway. That's what the false spirit said. See, the thing about all of this is what really irks my nerves is that this person included you. The thing about it is you, you were never bothering nobody. They should have just left you the fuck alone in the beginning. A bitch can't even do what the fuck they're born to do without a hoe sitting up here fucking hating or a nigga. I'm not going to make this really long at all, bro. Because this shit, I'm, I'm sick of this. Community. And it's all how they look in the community or something. Trying to wrestle with a real divine masculine or a real divine fucking feminine, bro. Something about to happen to where God is allowing some shit. And I guess you just have to use your discernment on your end here, fem masculine. This bitch or this nigga is in despair. They're sad as fuck. They're crying every goddamn day. Who gives a fuck? Nobody cares. They're crying over the privileged lady. It's always somebody fucking with the privileged goddamn lady. They feel like everything is handed to you or it's so fucking easy, but they're unofficial as fuck. Bitch, it ain't up to you to sit back and judge the next person to what the fuck they deserve. 
You don't know what type of life somebody don't live, ho. What's the allowance here? A lot of y'all bitches need to get the DNA on your child straight, ho. You need to find out who the fuck your baby daddy is, bitch. Why the fuck you up here worrying about this family this masculine? They're not putting an end to this shit. Coughing is in the reverse. I'm just telling you. They're doing too goddamn much. What else is here for our Angel Michael? And maybe they thought that they put an end to you. Man, please. You're never going to be ended. Somebody is getting a divorce with marriage in reverse. They're mad. But see, I don't feel like they got nothing to fucking do with you here. 228 is what I seen when I just looked at my phone. I seen 228. Okay, you I feel like a whole need to mind their business, bro, and they just never will. Yeah, they can't steal shit. Something is falling down for these hoes. It's a lot of shit that's out of order. The restroom is fucking pie here. <laughs> I don't feel like it's you. I feel like it's them. It's always you versus them. This shit is getting so fucking old, bro. I would like to pick up on something different. But I forgot this new moon. Bitch, it's an April Fool's joke if you think you're going to get one over on this masculine or this feminine hoe. It's an April Fool's joke if you think that you're ever in your life going to meet the statue of this person. You would never in your life have the abilities, the capabilities, none of that shit, bitch, of this motherfucking family or this masculine. Y'all hoes trying to do magic to take people gifts and shit. Bitch, go get a fucking life, hoe. Why don't you do a fucking spell to get to know yourself, ho? Why don't you do some kind of spell, bitch-ass nigga? To love yourself or something. I don't get this. These hoes got a spell for everything, but can't even goddamn direct their own life. Masculine. This wealthy man here might have sent you a message, fam. But somebody is hacking into your devices. It could be a family member here. For sure. Could be one of these losing-ass niggas here. From your past. It don't got to be a family member. You could just have a child with this person. I feel like this person might. Work. Like in IT or something. This is somebody that does shit with computers. Why is discernment here? I'm just so sick of this shit bro. False person and then this main female. You need to have some kind of discernment. Because it's a fake bitch in the energy here. Masculine fam. I seen one, two, three, four. Y'all motherfuckers think these people y'all friend, they're not. It ain't a bitch in this world I fucking trust. And I don't give a fuck how much you smile in my face. I don't trust anyone. And maybe you should get that same motherfucking demeanor. Don't trust no goddamn body. Nobody is to be trusted. You're a divine masculine, divine femme. You can't just be running around chasing, uh, chasing and trusting motherfuckers. So something is not going right in a courthouse situation here. And see, these people know this, so I guess they're trying to include you. It doesn't have anything to do with you, though. Somebody was trying to steal some shit from you. And I guess that they thought, which they thought fucking wrong. I guess they thought you were going to get them out of a pickle here because you're family or because you love them. Yeah, fucking right, bitch. If you did some shit, ho, you're going to pay for that shit, bitch. This person should not be concerned about you, but they're always concerned. Okay, and maybe they're concerned too. It's a it's a death here. It's some kind of fucking somebody killed somebody. I feel. I feel like somebody's a fucking serial killer. <laughs> I also feel like too somebody be trying to fucking kill people with spell work here. Like I said, motherfuckers is going to jail and they're never the fuck getting out. And they're expecting this already, my son, fam. They already know what their fate is. This immature bitch right here was trying to steal great fortune from you and have you in poverty, but that would never happen. See, what the fuck this hoe don't understand was that was a gift for you and she shouldn't have touched it. This hoe shouldn't have never touched your shit. And then these motherfuckers will sit up here and steal shit from... Look, I can't lie. Thief at the bottom. They'll sit up here and steal shit from you and then have thousands of people gang stalking you. And you don't even know the fuck why. Bruh, half of y'all do not even know why, bruh. It's like, what am I fighting for? But you just know you're fighting. Your whole life you've been fighting. But recently, for the last year or two, a lot of y'all been fighting real hard. 
You've been fighting off a lot of negative demonic energies here. And it's because of something that somebody is trying to steal from you. Whether it be a relationship or some kind of money. <laughs> Somebody birthday, August 2nd, August the 26th, August 17th, August 28th, August 19th. Okay, here, November the 23rd, November the 4th, the 11th. The 8th. Okay. February 26th. February 17th. February 28th. The 19th. February 4th. October 13th. The 19th. The 6th. October 17th. May 11th. May 4th. May 5th. <clears throat> I'm not staying in this energy long at all. Fuck, no I'm not, okay here? Hell no. This shit is very low fucking vibrational, bro. The tower's at the bottom. It's always a tower fucking moment. Why are there so many towers here? Ace of Swords truth. That's just the fucking truth. Like I said, it's towers, Page of Swords. These people are stalking you, doing magic. Wondering why the fuck they magic not working and shit. But see, I feel like they may be stalking you only to see, you know, if their magic is working in this fucking night. That shit is backfiring. And these hoes know with the chariot that karma coming for their ass. Somebody wants you to give up everything that you've done. They want you to move on and Forget that you ever had a mission. They want you to move on and forget that you ever had a life. They don't want you to know who the fuck you are. They want you... Man, what the fuck is this? Bitch, why does it matter what the fuck you want, ho? Why don't you do something for yourself? These bitches gonna be in the five of goddamn pinnacles left out in the cold for the shit that they're working together uh, to do to you. These bitches always trying to steal something, bruh. Oh, I forgot this new moon. Ace of goddamn pentacles here. Duh. Ace of swords, ace of pentacles. The privileged lady. Fam. Masculine. These people are stealing. Look at the ace of wands. You got every ace there is, and I'm sure will come the fuck out. The ten of swords in reverse. Whatever this is, you're not going to be able to heal it. Whatever the fuck this is, you're not going to be able to heal it. This shit is dead. It's over the fuck with. It's done. Okay, here. I just really the fuck feel like that. I really feel these hoes know it's fucking over. And they're trying to do some kind of magic spell. Bitch, it's too late. Justice is here, ho. Could be a Libra here. Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Okay, with the three of cups. These people are working together to try so goddamn hard. These hoes are trying too motherfucking hard. Straight up, bro. Definitely could be a Capricorn with the devil. These people are overindulging in their fuck shit. These people are addicted to doing fucking magic, bro. They're addicted. They're not going to do sh Look, what did I say? They're addicted to doing magic with the Queen of Wands in reverse. This shit is not fucking working. Eight of Pentacles in reverse, bitch. That shit is not fucking working. It's nothing working. That's why they keep doing this shit. They think something's going to change, but it's not. These hoes, it's a missed opportunity, bitch. I'm going to show you up close and personal, ho, that you missed an opportunity. Four of Cups. Four of Pentacles. The Sun card in reverse. Could be a lame losing Leo. These people have lost their motherfucking mind. And this is all they do every single day is worry the fuck about you. Queen of Cups in reverse. This motherfucker right here or these people, two of cups, four of wands, here with the ten of pentacles. Somebody just do not want you to come in together with someone else, bro. Or they're stealing money or something. And they know exactly what the hell they're doing, man. 
Look, the Three of Pentacles is in the damn reverse with the Knight of Cups. They don't want something to work out. They don't want somebody to make you an offer or something. But see, the thing of it is, why the fuck I keep trying to figure out why the fuck does a bitch feel like whatever she thinks is good for you and your life matters? If God ordained something, why is these hoes trying to fuck with your faith? A lot of these people are doing magic on you so that you can maybe self-sabotage. They want you to be frustrated. They want all kind of shit to go on so you can mess up something for yourself. Whoever the fuck this person is that wants to be with you, fam, masculine, they already know who you are, so this shit is old. These people are doing this shit for no fucking reason, truly. Does this, does the energy ever get any better? I fucking doubt it. Because it's always somebody, old or fucking new, that feel like they can come into your lane. And these hoes ain't even got no insurance at all. I'm sick of this. Didn't I say the death card was going to come out? Didn't I say that? Scorpion energy. Still losing Scorpio here. You got the ace of wands, ace of fucking swords, ace of pentacles here, fam masculine. Knight of wands in the reverse. Something happening quicker than expected. And the seven of swords. Maybe this person is getting caught quicker than they thought. Somebody is getting caught the fuck up, bruh. And these people, they didn't know who you were. So forgive them. World card. Didn't I say all these motherfucking cards are gonna come? Damn near every deacon of Scorpio is out here. Damn near. This person got a lot of devilish fucking thoughts about you here, fam masculine. All they do all day is wonder or worry about you and your success instead of putting that shit into themselves. Bitch, if you ain't, if you wasn't so fucking worried about the next hoe, what they doing and how the fuck they doing shit and when, and when they win and how, bitch, you might could think of a formula to win, ho. But instead, you'll never be a fucking empress. This could be a, a mother figure or something. I don't fucking know. But it's the Empress in the reverse and the King of Wands fuck nigga, Leo Aries Sag here. That's trying to prevent you from something here, privileged lady. The Four of Swords. Star card, all because you're a star. All because you're God's baby. All because you sleep good at fucking night not worrying about shit. And all they do is stay up doing spell work. These people are up 3, 4, 5 o'clock in the fucking morning doing spells. Didn't I say the tower was going to come out? This is a Scorpio. You hoes are losers. Queen of Swords in the reverse here. The Hermit. Seven of the damn pinnacles. Strength card. Could be a Leo for sure. Virgo energy. Aquarius energy. This is a fight that who the fuck even knows what it's for. Man, these people so damn fucked up in the mind, they don't even know what they're fighting you for anymore. I'm telling you what the hell the facts are. These people literally don't even know why they're fighting you. Look at the temperance. Could be a sad here. Seven of swords in reverse. They're being caught and caught the fuck out too. This is too much. All over a ten of fucking pentacles here. Let me get another deck to clarify this shit, bro. 24 minutes. Yeah, I'm not standing this energy long at all. This shit is just weird, bro. Uh, look at the ten of swords. These hoes attempts are so fucking unsuccessful. I seen the seven of swords again. 
I'm, just, I'm sick of this shit, bro. I wish these folks would die. I just really do. And I mean that from the bottom of my heart. They need to fucking die and just go. This kind of people, this kind of energy just needs to die out and go. What the fuck is this kind of energy here for? Unless it's a test for the divine beings. These energies obviously are tests for divine masculines and feminines. Obviously. Gotta be. This nigga done lost money. Who gives a fuck, bitch? Don't nobody give a fuck what the fuck you done lost. If you lost that shit, you lost it on your fucking own fuck, nigga. Moon card. Something is hidden here. They steadily hiding shit here, but they don't want to be fucking sneaky. Trying to release that shit onto you and project onto you like you're living your life wrong or something here. Okay? That's not the case at all, fam. That's when don't ever feel like that. And that's just what the hell I'm feeling like. I'm telling you, the high priestess. These people already know they lost. But they're still going to try to fight anyhow. This four of cups is never not going to come out for these people. Okay? The ten of pentacles is in the reverse. Bitch, you're not getting shit, ho. Get a fucking life, nigga. You're not getting anything. If you thought you were going to steal something from this masculine or this feminine, whether it be a person or money, you're not getting anything, bitch. Oh, but you already know this, right? You know this already. And maybe the energy is so heavy because of this fucking moon. Look. So I like Kelsey. <coughs> Kelsey or Kelvin or something. Three of Wands waiting, sitting back, waiting for their moon magic to work. Bitch, it'll never work. Six of Wands is in the reverse. It won't be successful. Instead of you sitting down praying and chanting to the moon, why don't you go and ask God to help your ass? With some kind of mental stability, ho. Y'all bitches are mentally unstable doing spell work. Now, that's the worst kind of fucking combination if I don't know one, bro. Star card, Aquarius energy. These hoes are working very diligently here. Trying to invest in some shit that's just never going to work. First of all, this feminine or this masculine is too goddamn strong. They're mentally strong as fuck, bitch. You will never in your life mentally be able to beat this masculine or this fam. But in this whole or in this nigga's mind, cancer energy, Aquarius energy, like I said, eight of swords, they feel like it's a way and it's not. They sit back waiting on nothing to fucking happen here. Nothing is happening for them. Shit is literally just thrown off course here. With the two of fucking uh, pentacles. Temperance could be a Sag. Sag, Cancer, Aquarius. I'm so sick of y'all folks, bro. I'm sick of this energy. I'm sick of reading this stupid shit. This damn King of Swords here. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius with judgment. I feel like somebody might have misjudged you or misjudged the situation. Somebody is. This King of Swords is like an attorney or something. I feel it's some shit about to be brought to your attention. You didn't know anything about it. Okay, you just that's how I feel. I feel like that for real, guys. <laughs> I don't feel like you're going to lose out. I feel like you're still working on yourself. You're still working. You're not going to be heartbroken. You don't really give a fuck is what I'm saying. It's an ending with the world card. There is truly an ending here. And motherfuckers just do not want to realize this. King of Wands strength here definitely could be a fucking losing ass Leo. That's investing their time and trying to destroy you when they need to be investing into a fucking good attorney. They're not walking away with the Eight of Cups in reverse. Whatever this is, is so goddamn serious that they don't want to get caught. Cancer Pisces, Scorpio, Queen of Cups in reverse. Like I said, they're holding on here. This bitch will never be an empress. 
This hole is never going to be in any deck I pull in Empress. Not in the upright. Fuck no. They're being sneaky. Demonic. Stealing. Lying. Five of Swords. Page of Swords watching. Like I said. To see if their magic is working. And it's not. Sick of this shit. I am so sick of this shit. I've been picking up on this energy for over a year. So yeah, I am sick of this shit. You fucking right I am. These hoes have been prolonging this shit for too fucking long. And that's just the truth. Aquarius energy with the Queen of Swords in reverse. Queen of Cups. Uh, Empress in reverse. This hoe is every queen in the reverse. Empress in the reverse. This bitch. Panda. What else is here, Spirit? I'm done with this shit. What else is here? Look at the page of swords. That's just what I'm trying to tell you here, fam. My son. These folks stalking you. They're sitting back, watching, waiting, trying to figure out what the fuck to do next. It ain't shit to fucking do next, bitch, but mind your fucking business, ho. It ain't shit else to do next, ho, but mind your motherfucking business, bitch. Something just is not right, and I'm telling you, something is not going to go right in court for people. They don't want you to come in together with someone. They're doing dark magic. Look at the queen of wands here, but this bitch is left in a fucking cold in a tower, period. And that's just justice, ho, because that's what you get when you can't pay the devil back, bitch. I feel like this person even had been trying to send energy your way here. Okay, here. They might have been trying to send low vibrational energy your way to get you to turn to the devil. Because they owe the devil something from you and they can't obtain it. So they're trying to get you to turn to the devil for yourself. This shit is weird, shawty. I wish people would mind their fucking business. That's a wish. That I know for sure is going to come true. It got to. Bitch, mind your business, ho. Page of Pentacles here in the reverse. Lover's card in the reverse. Could be a Gemini. Could be an Aries here with the Fool card as well. Okay? And equal give and take. Some called karma, bitches and niggas. Bitch, why don't you mind your fucking business, ho? And maybe you won't have to pay karma. You wouldn't be in a situation you're in if you would mind your fucking business. You keep trying to set traps with this divine femme or masculine. Bitch, but you're the only one truly indeed trapped. These bitches trying to get people to kill you and shit, master, fam. Four of Wands in the reverse, okay? All you do, I feel, is mind your business and work on your legacy, bro. A lot of you all are working on leaving a legacy. And this person is refusing to walk away from you because they know you're doing great shit. But see, the thing about all of this, the thing about this shit that's killing me, and I'm still alive, is these motherfucking bitches ain't walking away and they're in the background. They're not coming to you telling you they got a problem with you building a legacy. These hoes are hating ass bitches and niggas that sit in the background and throw magic at you, period. These fake ass motherfuckers wanna be spiritualists here. Yeah, I know I'm bringing you bad news, so fuck you, bitch. These bitches got damn near a million motherfucking subscribers and followers, but they on your little old page. Stopping you and following you. Weren't wondering about what the fuck you doing. All because of this team of cups. These bitches be pulling cards on you doing readings. Trying to figure out who this person is coming into your life. But I wonder why they can't read their own energy to see who's coming into theirs. I wonder why the fuck these bitches don't put in the effort to read their own birth charts and study themselves here to see who the fuck it is they supposed to be. contract card at the bottom. Like I said, the empress is in the reverse. This hoe will never be an empress in her motherfucking life. This hoe will never impress anyone. Nobody is interested in this trashy ass motherfucking hoe here. This bitch is trash in a hefty bag. A big bag of bull fucking shit. And a three of swords heartbroken because you held back from them or you fucking cut their ass off. 
But why did you cut them off their masculine? Because they're toxic and they're liars and they're cheaters and they're thieves, period. You cut them off for the right reason. They're mad at you because you did the right shit. Now let's you, now let's put the shoe on the other foot. Let you be this energy, being conniving and sneaky. This person right here would make sure that they cover their ass from you. They would make sure that they're doing magic to keep you away from them. So why the fuck are they doing so much fucking magic to keep you away from your destiny? You don't even fuck with this person. You walked away from them. Maybe that's why they're mad. How the fuck somebody gonna be mad at you for doing what's better for you? How the fuck somebody gonna be mad at you because they're bullshit and you caught on? How the fuck is somebody gonna be mad at that? I don't get it, bro. So losing ass, scorpion asshole, period. The Emperor. It's all because of this fucking King of Cups, Emperor, King of Pentacles, whatever the fuck. <laughs> this nigga right here won't even move. So, you know, but see, that's what they doing magic for. So this nigga won't come towards you. This nigga right here, <clears throat> whoever the fuck this Emperor is, this nigga ain't got no backbone, obviously. So I don't even know how the fuck this is an emperor. This person won't even approach you here, fam. That's exactly why people are doing magic so they moan. But see, the thing about it is, I don't feel like you give a fuck about this person. You don't, half of y'all don't even know that someone's interested in you. You're minding your business, getting your own bread here, fam. You're building your own fucking legacy. You got your own paper route here. Rest in peace, of young dog. Shit is sad. This is an Aries here, could be. This person could be an Aries or a Sag. They so in love with you, though. They so in love with you, fam. Masculine, you so fucking in love, but you sitting there like a fucking statue. Nigga, move the fuck on, nigga. Move around, nigga. Go get another bitch right here. Leave this feminine alone. Because the more your weak ass, because you're a weak nigga, because you won't move, you're weak. The more you don't move, and the more you show interest, the more this fam is attacked. Nigga, go on the fuck on, nigga. Straight up. I'm sick of y'all, bro. I'm sick of you fuck niggas that can't speak, and I'm sick of you motherfucking bitches that's trying to prevent this person from speaking. It ain't no magic in the world that's gonna make me not open my mouth and say what the fuck is on my mind. You got me fucked up. Bitch, you not block hole. You can talk, can't you, nigga? Your hands work, nigga. I feel like everybody in this situation got something to do with this feminine being blocked. This person wants to come in and make a move. Bitch, fuck you because you ain't dead shit. Period. Period. You ain't dead shit and you're not going to. So stop fucking stalking this feminine. Stop wanting this feminine because this feminine is way stronger than the fuck you. You're not being attacked. The family is. I'm sick of this shit. Bitch, move the fuck around, nigga. It's a thousand niggas in this fucking world. Matter of fact, it's way more. Like I said, 60 swords, move the fuck around, nigga. Because I'm going to tell you like this, fam. And that's just the ace of swords true. A lot of these fuck niggas ain't even going to come to you at all. They just going to sit back and do spells. These fuck niggas doing spells on you, too. Hoping that you never meet nobody so they can come in to you after they get out of a relationship that they're never going to end. Bitch, be with whoever you're with and leave this fam alone. That's what I'm trying to tell you. You are the main reason, masculine, why this fam is being fucking attacked, bitch. I know exactly what the fuck I feel. You're never going to do shit. Never. You never was. So, why the fuck are you using this feminine energy to try to make your karmic ass, bullshit ass bitch get right or get some kind of class about herself. 
like I said, you're never, you're never gonna approach this feminine. So why don't you leave her the fuck alone, bitch? You're the reason why she's being attacked, fuck nigga. Straight up, bro. Nobody give a fuck about your money or what the fuck you got going on, bitch. Fuck you. It ain't shit in this world that's worth a person being stalked every goddamn day in a set with magic. Bitch, are you being attacked? No, you're not. Ace of Wands here. It's a whole nother King of Cups sad nigga right here that want this film. Bitch, nobody gives a fuck about your money. Move your solid, stiff ass the fuck out the way, statue ass nigga. This nigga could be from New York. This nigga think he a king of... Nigga, take your ass on then, bitch. You ain't even got enough nerve to speak. You ain't shit, bitch. And I'm gonna tell you that. Any fuck nigga that want me that don't speak, bitch, fuck you. Don't, don't say shit to me and don't want me at all. I don't want no nigga who ain't got no motherfucking balls, bitch. I want me a man that don't give a fuck what nobody think. What the fuck is wrong with your stupid ass, nigga? Death card in reverse. You got young dumb assholes practicing magic and paying people magic. Paying people to do magic on this motherfucking film. All because of you. This motherfucking masculine be telling this bitch, this karmic shit about you. Like y'all just fuck with each other. You don't even know this person. This fuck nigga using your name to make this bitch be a better bitch. She should have been whatever you needed, nigga. Fuck is you talking about? I don't give a fuck because the emperor came out, nigga. You ain't shit. That emperor, that emperor card don't mean shit to me because of the feelings I'm getting with it, bitch. Leave this fucking feminine alone, fuck nigga. You gonna have some badass luck, nigga, because of the shit you're doing. Because you know exactly what you're doing. Sitting back, stopping this film. You sitting back, watching this film, hoping that this karmic hoe walk in on you, watching this film. Knowing that that bitch gonna go run and do some kind of magic trick on this film. You're a fucking loser, nigga. You bitches are losers too. It ain't a bitch in the world that I would just be that invested in, ho. Nigga, you want that bitch go get her. I ain't never in my life thought of a nigga. That's one thing you won't catch me doing is fighting over no dick. You got me fucked up, bitch. That's what you lame ghetto assholes do. You fight over a nigga. Girl, I don't want to break a nail on you stupid bitches. Me? Hell is you saying, ho. If you don't want to get shot, bitch, you better stay the fuck back, bitch. This person right here feel like they your motherfucking end all be all, fam. My friend. With this slow ass night of damn pentacles offer. A lot of y'all are being attacked because this emperor keeps putting you in the way of a karmic. Mentioning your name or something around this bitch. You don't even know this person. But they're using you as some kind of example for this bitch to go within and find herself. Somehow they want this bitch to be you. That's why this whole studying you. Copying. Stalking. Watching. I seen 4343. Yeah, like I said, fuck nigga. You need to move the fuck around, bitch, with the six of swords. The three of damn pentacles and the ten of cups in reverse. You don't want no fucking family with this feminine. And stop trying to act like it, bitch. Why don't you stay the fuck out her energy, fuck nigga? And you know damn well the bitch that you fuck with do magic. Because y'all do it together, hoe ass nigga. Whole nigga, you and this bitch doing magic together, bitch ass nigga. What I say? The magician. You're doing magic. The nine of pentacles is a single abundant motherfucker. You're not single. Both of you all are doing this shit to this feminine. And you're addicted to her energy. Stop trying to make it seem like this is her wish fulfillment. You are not this fucking feminist wish fulfillment, bitch. And for you fuck niggas and you bitches to try to act like you can manipulate energy and play this divine feminine, bitch, you're stupid. 
Her discernment is very motherfucking on point. And that may be why discernment came out here, fam. You need to be motherfucking careful. There is a soulmate here, but this emperor is not it. Not this one. You got justice coming. Libra energy. It's like four deacons of Libra here. Two of swords I see. Look, the ace of pentacles in reverse. Death in reverse. This person is not putting an end to this shit. And it only got something to do with a karmic being a better bitch. But why are you the example? I wonder why it's you. They're trying to take shit from you. Why? Why don't y'all be together or something? Ain't you with this person? Or you got contact with them? Bitch, why don't you go be with them and leave this fucking film alone? This film ain't got nothing to do with y'all. But they're sick. Both of them are sick. Sitting back stalking and watching you. And this nigga really got this whole thinking that they know that they know you or something. You do not know this person. But your name is in their household. Is what I'm telling you. And fuck nigga, if you thought I couldn't see through the energy, you a fucking fool. Everybody that shows up as an emperor is not your fucking counterpart. Somebody named Robert. This some shit from back in the motherfucking day. These people been doing this shit. Been stalking you, been worrying about you, the sun card here with the Empress in reverse. Like I said, this is a karmic couple stealing Femme's energy here. Oh, wait, you're... Let's just be real, fuck, nigga. That's what you're doing, bitch. You don't, you're not interested in this Femme, bitch. You're just trying to take her essence and put it with a karmic hoe that would never have it. I feel like you need to mind your business before you get your head blowed the fuck back, bitch. By spirit, period. This fuck nigga even got the nerve to try to physically come towards you or physically send somebody towards you here. The fuck is wrong with you people, bro? What else is here, spirit? I'm gonna get the fuck up out of this damn energy, period. Give me one more card for the collective. Yeah, Midnight Prince in the damn reverse. Like I said, this fuck nigga is not it, fam. Green is bright. This person is literally connected already with a fucking karmic. The Merlin. Bitch, I know what the fuck I'm talking about. Virgo energy. They're connected already with a karmic and they want this karmic to be you. They wish that this karmic had qualities that you have. The three graces here. Like I said, they're working together. Solis, get the fuck outside and go goddamn do something else, bitch ass nigga. Cry for nature. Mourning for something sacred which seems lost. Like I said, you got something that this nigga wish this karmic hoe had. And this nigga got something that you don't need at all. I don't give a fuck. I would choose the king of cups over an emperor any day. The emperor is supposed to be every king of the dead, but not this one. This emperor is fucking sneaky. All they do is sit back in the background, watch you, and compare you to a karmic. Bring up your name and that whole goes start doing magic, period. The Grail Fairy, bitch. The hell is you talking about? What else here? A lot of y'all, your family is just stealing money. But a lot of you all, the person that's trying to steal your essence and your vibe, it's a fuck-ass emperor. But he wants his karmic to be like you and that hoe is stalking you. These people that got money and status and fame and shit. But they're stalking little old you trying to take all your essence, drain you of everything so this bitch could be some shit she would never be. I don't give a fuck how much money you got, hoe. You would never in your life be this divine femme. You're very slow at a snail's pace when it comes to this motherfucking divine feminine hoe. It's a lot you gotta do to catch up to this person. This film got it out the mud, bitch. Secret doorway, you don't have one, ho. You don't got no motherfucking fairies and shit working with you, bitch. This motherfucking film is divine. You're tripping. And see, film, I feel discernment came out because you're gonna use you gonna use your discernment with this emperor. 
Somebody, this person might literally still try to come and say something to you. Into the woods, the littlest fairy. They may still try to come and say something to you, but you're not going to fall for it. Period. Okay. Yeah. All the, all the men are in reverse. This person does not want you. They don't truly want a relationship with you. They want this big uh, beauty and the beast ass bitch right here who's scared to fly or scared to do anything on her own because any idea she has is bullshit. This whole sit back and follow you. They, this person follows you from fake ass pages here, fam. I don't care if you got 30 motherfucking subscribers. It's a celebrity stalking you. I'm going to just tell you that. A bitch that claimed to be rich or something. All because this fucking emperor is trying to make it seem like he knows you. I'm done with this reading. Carry me home, support, time to be carried, allow others to help. Like I said, this fuck nigga sitting back watching you trying to get use you as a study guy for this fucking karmic asshole to be more like you. They're trying to steal your essence. Your divinity and your path. Period. You got family, all kind of shit out here, fam masculine. But just understand whoever this is that you're trying to date or that's trying to whoever the fuck, this emperor is not real. I'm telling you, this person fake as fuck. Okay, here. <laughs> 